Hey, what's up? So right now, today, I just ordered Windows 8 Professional for $14. Since I recently have a new PC, which is the Alienware M14X, which I'm in, which right now I'm installing on the desktop, and then afterwards I'm gonna install it on my laptop. So right now, I'm ready to install which I'm installing Windows 8 Professional and I selected don't keep anything since I want to start fresh and the time is 10 26 p.m. and today is the 25th October 25th 2012 and now I'm going to begin to install and the reason why I'm not having the then now we'll keep the camera still is because there's no good way for the, in this my bedroom to keep the camera still or clear quality. So now time to begin the installation. So now it pops up installing Windows 8. Your PC will start several times. This might take a while. So now it's 10% complete. And I'm installing it from the USB since I don't basically use CD drives anymore. And plus, this desktop is inspired by 30S, if I recall, which has 3 gigabytes of RAM and Intel, but it's not really a good chip to begin with, but it still works for browsing and other usage like some gaming like gaming basically so now it's going to take a while Thirteen percent complete so earlier I have few issues with Windows 8 installation first part was to then I decided to upgrade it from through the BIOS and picked up the USB to install it like what I do with Windows 7 but it turns out it doesn't do that that way. I do the other way. I reinstall Windows 7 again then do all the updates then start with the Windows 8 upgrade which wasted around 2 hours for me since I began at 8 o'clock p.m. and so now it's nearly 10.30 and so now I'm going to put this camcorder on hold for like a little while but I'll tell you the exact time and such when it starts the installation when it basically completes the installation and right now the time is 10.30 p.m. and knowing this installation it's going to be fast basically since the first installation I did to install Windows 8 it only took around 10 minutes instead of 30 minutes of when I had to do Windows 7 and so now I'm going to begin with the video on pause for like 10 or wherever, wherever this gets to complete. So now I just restarted the computer. It's been like 10 minutes later. So it's been like 10.30 and now it's 10.40. So now you see the new Metro Windows 8 look. And it should be signed up out then. But it only took 10 minutes, like 15 minutes altogether for the installation. And now it says preparing 50%. And another restart.
and it's still saying no. So now it's getting your devices ready. This means it's still on everything else inside the desktop. Then they have your devices with drivers. And that's done. And now it's getting ready. And another will start. And now it's moving, moving your settings. Now personalize, wireless, etc. So now it's time to personalize. So let's see which color should I pick. That's the way I like the red. So now, as usual, I'm going to put it as in PC. And this is personalized. And now that's. I'm going to do customize and this is the first time on the network to watch a channel between pieces that connect to devices on this network hmm well this is a home network so I'm going to go for yes I'm going to let's see Windows update I'm going to allow and protect your privacy in your PC Send your else. This should help a little bit. And yep. Yep. And now let's put my email address, which I'm gonna need two hands. Because I want to get this email finished. And by putting the email address, you, you, when you sign up with Windows or Microsoft account, you can download apps from the Windows Store. Get your con online content with Microsoft apps automatically. And sync. Yep. Now it's checking for your um, for, for, checking for Microsoft account. And now it's time to put my password. And now it's add security info. Since I don't want to reveal my number to the public, so. And now it's creating an account. Finalizing your sentence. Some slight inter interruption, so yeah. Now it's getting your PC ready. Which looks nice anyway. And now it's installed maps. So this Windows installation took less half hour basically.
which is pretty impressive since Windows Vista took like around 15 30 minutes while Windows 7 it's like almost the same but XP has got to be a little bit at the longest to me but anyways Windows 8 I tried it out in Best Buy and it was pretty impressive so that's why I decided to purchase it for my own but when I get rid of Metro apps they come to default and put your own Metro applications and so of your own customization so it will improve your customer experience or your experience of your own but all I know is one thing that does not come supported as well is my webcam that's up here which is a lot lock attack and this is the start screen which is not really set up yet as is usual I always like to delete I'm gonna do a little bit more personalization by giving me a fit like because I like to keep the entire screen clear and surprise in a flower you got internet explorer and it's blur and settings PC info and your windows is activated using 3 gigabyte and it's a 32 bit and it's dual core E5200 2.5 gigahertz Windows 8 Pro and now when I start dealing with um, Windows 8 on uh, my Alienware soon and then when I'm done I should have this entire Metro setup complete and so I just hope you enjoyed the video about Windows 8 Pro upgrading from Windows 7 to 8 and as usual gotta fix the time zones I hate when I have to do this all the time but so I hope you all enjoyed the video about me upgrading my Windows 7 professional to Windows 8 professional on my desktop and the time is 10.55 p.m. and today is the first day of Windows 8 released to the general public and so I hope you enjoyed the video